Bushcraft Rebel here. Um, I've been putting out, have not been putting out a lot of videos. I've had some knee issues and whatnot. It's been slowing me down a little bit. But, uh, I can go see a doctor Wednesday. He should help me out and take care of it. But I want to do some reveals today. I do have a couple things to show. So, for starters, let me see. Here. Put this in its case. We've got this one here. Which is 1074. It is all handmade. I'm not 100% happy with the sheath I made. I'm kind of starting out on those. Damn, I look huge. Yeah, big fat guy. But I'm not, I'm getting better with them. This was kind of my first run at one. As you can see, the knife is really nice. I did etch the blade to make it look, give it an older look. Did something special with the handle so it would look old as well but I'm not a hundred percent happy with the sheath just not a hundred percent happy so we've got that one that one's been in the making for a while here's my second attempt and my sheaths begin in the beginning of a lot better also the knife is pretty nice too the uh, knife has a hickory handle it's a imitation alligator I do believe pretty nice looking um, knife turned out really nice got so much light in here it's just, everything shines once again I etched the blade nice hickory handle and she is a cutter I will tell you that made a uh, the, the uh, imitation stuff here is a lot stouter and thicker. I think I like it a little better. I'm trying to use different things to make the sheet so you know I don't kind of get in a rut of okay I built a knife and we pull the leather out and make a leather sheath and stuff like that you know have everything the same now. I think this one I hit a home run with. I think it looks pretty good. You guys can let me know in the comments. Use the suede leather. The red is, I don't know if it's imitation or if it's dyed suede leather. Watch this. Look, look at this monster. This thing is a monster. Once again, also, this one is 1074. And I got a little play, a little playing around with this one. So, on this side is an oak handle. Or not oak, on my bad. Is a hickory handle. On your other side is a cedar handle. I have another video where I show the sharpness of this thing, but it is, I mean, it's a beast. Put it next to the hand. I'm actually really proud of this one. I think the sheath turned out really well. So, not going to put a long video out. Just wanted to kind of show these off. Um, this one is up for sale. You can hit me up in the comments if you want any more information about it. Same, uh... I haven't decided on this one yet. I may send this one to a subscriber to test, but I'm not for sure yet. But uh, we're getting there. And of course, this is the Grim knife. He'll have it back here in just a little bit. Hopefully, he likes the new sheath that it comes with. If not, well, he can buy one. Ah ha ha. I don't think it's a bad one. I think it will hold up well. And the knife stays in it really well. So, um, hopefully after the knee gets taken care of. And I think I'm supposed to get a shot or something to help with it. And hopefully I'll be back on my feet like I'm supposed to. And I'll be able to go ahead and start putting out some videos for you guys. So, until that time, Bushcraft Rebel, signing out.